I'm, uh, what you would commonly refer to as an asshole. That thing that, uh, makes a lot of people dislike you. See, when I was fucking growing up, man, I was always told it, it was not a good idea to be an asshole. You know, no, 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 nobody likes you. You're a fucking asshole. And, uh, yeah, no, I just surround myself with other assholes, and it's almost like, uh, we're good friends. Like, there's just people on the internet, man. They, they bitch and complain, like, how come I don't have any friends? Why can't I get a girlfriend? I don't understand. And I'm kind of like, you know, bitch, what, what the fuck are you talking about? Like, motherfucker, maybe you're just an uninteresting, pathetic cunt, you know? Maybe, maybe, maybe there's nothing going on in your life. You know? It's just like, it fucking... I hate fucking people who do that shit. Like, they're bitching and complaining like, I can't get a girlfriend. Hey. I can't either, motherfucker. And you want to know why? I don't have a fucking job. And I don't make money. Well, a substantial amount of money that allows me to do things outside of sitting on my ass and spending $100 on Rainbow Six. You know, you know, it's even funnier, though. Like, these people, at the very least, these fucking incel virgin type, you know, the, 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 we as men should all collectively get together and suck each other's dicks for the betterment of society. It's not gay, I'm wearing socks. You know, if, if these guys would just collectively realize that, hey, you know, may maybe, uh, maybe if I got up off my ass, you know, I socialized a little bit more. You know, I, I, I just tried, you know, I self-deprecated that I'm such a faggot because I can't fucking hold a fucking job at Taco Bell because people fucking annoy the shit out of me and I have a sailor's mouth. Ugh. You know, at least, at the very least, you know, maybe I shouldn't have called that guy a faggot because he was being a little arrogant in the drive through You know, maybe I shouldn't have been brutally honest with him and told him, hey, you don't have to be an asshole. Maybe I could say something along the lines of, you're being a jerk, and I really don't have to serve you, instead of calling him an asshole. You know? That's, that's one of the reasons why I can't hold a fucking job. You know? And, and maybe maybe if I uh, tried to better myself... I know, it, it's, it's fucking shocking, you know? But uh, maybe if I tried to better myself and say, hey... You know, may, 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 maybe, uh, the, you know, the service industry really isn't a good idea. Maybe that's not a, you know, not a very good employment option. Maybe, uh, I struggle with people, which is completely understandable. Uh, but may, maybe if I tried a different career path, may, may, maybe then I'd have a little bit more luck with women. But the, these fucking faggots, bro, like, they, they bitch and complain, like, I don't understand why Stacy doesn't love me. Like I, I get the whole Chad Stacy meme. Let's let's not let's not get on that. I, I I I I hate Becky too. Let's 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 be real. You know. Oh my God, Becky! Oh, his get storm. <laughs> I get that. I'm I'm completely on your side. Those women deserve a, a fucking noose. Let's let's not get on that. You know. Fuck, man. But like, when you bitch and complain consistently, like, maybe there's something wrong with you. Maybe, maybe a little introspection, you know? Yeah, maybe, maybe. You know, I was a fucking virgin tile too, dude. I was, I was a bloody fucking MGTARD. Let's, let's not get on that fucking, the fucking, I've never gotten laid in my life. It's just, stop bitching. Really, I, I, I understand, I get it. It's it's somewhat a meme, but there are legit every every time someone says Pole is full of Nazis, there's there's for for every LARPer there's an actual fucking Nazi. You got this, my Which you know, I'll get on the whole ethno state meme in a minute. That's gonna be interesting. But uh, like what what the fuck are you doing, man? Like go go outside. You struggle with social skills. You have a little autism. Got some Aspergers. Interact with people. There are people out there who legitimately have autism, like, who are full, full social anxiety, like, having a stroke talking to people behind the counter at Taco Bell, you know? Find, find a common interest with one of those kind of people, and it may be, maybe then you'll, you'll fit in, and you'll develop social skills, and then you'll realize that these guys are a bunch of fucking weirdos, you know, and you'll meet another group of friends. Like if you if you struggle with socializing, you legitimately have autism. I completely understand. Just socialize a little bit more. Find someone who who doesn't 
Find someone who will laugh at your autism. Laugh with you. You know, it, ma maybe, maybe, maybe that'll fix your problem. And your whole dating life, you, you, you gotta... If you're gonna talk... Okay, look. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. Be real honest with you guys. If you're having trouble talking to women, if you're having trouble getting dates, get off of Tinder. Don't use Bumble, don't use any of that E shit. Alright, here's here's how you here's how a real Chad does it, you fucking virgin man. Let's you you little destiny clones. Here's how you fucking that chick behind the counter when you went up to buy a beer. Don't don't forget, I'm Chad Thundercock, so I know exactly what the fuck I'm saying, right? So I go up there, you ask her, like, hey, you know, I look like I'm 12, you know, it happens. Everybody thinks it's a fake ID. I, I know it's not. I'm, I'm telling you, I'm legal. Don't worry about it. And she turns around, looks at you, smiles, giggles, you know. She gets the joke. She sees what it is. She knows she's, you know, she's just fucking with her. And she goes, yeah, well, maybe, uh, maybe you should start fucking with people. Ask them for a lollipop. And you're like, yeah, that's a pretty good idea. I love fucking with people, eh? You know? And then you hit her with that shit, uh, that, that complicated shit, hey. You, you want to get a beer? And she will be on your dick in five seconds. Like, dude, you don't even know. Like, you're not even going to get it out of the parking lot. You're going to be fucking balls deep in that ass. Take her to a bar. I I'm doing the, the, the mind-blown reaction. Like, that, that's crazy. It's like, it's like women are humans, and if you communicate to them like they're humans, they'll respond. Like, no, it's... It's not hard. I don't know why you people think there's, like, some kind of fucking game to picking. No. Just... Look, I like playing video games. I like getting drunk. There's not a lot of females who like fucking getting trashed and playing video games, but... Come on, man. They're, they're just humans. They're just... They're just fucking humans. Talk to them. Just ask how their day was. There is no, I'm trying to be a... I'm trying to be a stud. I got an STD, now all I need is you! <laughs> I'm so punny! Let me- My dick just died, let me bury it in your ass! Like, come on man, there's- How was your day? You wanna get a beer? You look cute. Y you seem like a cool chick. Oh, I need to get a hooker to get laid. No, you need social skills. All right, and so when you when you start developing social skills, you you start making money. All right, you, you doesn't you don't even have you can be a broke motherfucker and just find some sexually deprived older woman who just who really wants to fucking bust a nut. She needs some she needs some good dick, and she she does not mind taking you out unless you know if you give her some good dick. I mean shit. Like you, you take a female out, you take a young girl out and take her out, you know, you can give her some, you wine and dine her first. Like, she'll wine and dine your ass. Just find some older chicks, like, shit, if you're, if you're fucking pull out, pull out game and on point, like, nigga, wear a rubber, fucking beat off before, you know. I, I legitimately feel bad for anyone who has these problems. Just go out and socialize. Shit, find find a scene you like. I'm I'm a funny guy. I'm an asshole. I have my moments. I have my my really good moments, and then I have my autistic moments. I enjoy comedy. It's a fucking art form. You know. Find some people who enjoy that as well. Find somebody who has the same sense of humor. And socialize with them. And eventually, you'll you'll gain enough social skills. That's one of them might you invite you to a comedy club. Or maybe, maybe, that chick behind the counter at Walmart who you, you made small talk with and she kind of got your sense of humor. That She, she kind of picked up on like you like fucking with people. Just ask her out to a dive bar or a comedy club. Maybe you hit it off, maybe you don't. Maybe you, you sit down and you cry yourself to sleep because it, it. Did, didn't work out. But, come on, man. It's not that difficult. It's really not. Work on yourself. Stop being a faggot. Jesus Christ. Planting toxins. Looking new magazine! Nice! Oh my
mission oh. successful. Is that an oh, ace? No, no but that was a 4K. Jesus. Give me that legion!